Armo with the socks rush and I'm reviewing Nvidia. So Nvidia gapped up today and I've been waiting for this to go. Uh, last night it was around 11.68 in the post market and it looks like it did get there. It did get back up there, 11.66 today. It was like late. So Nvidia is making another brand new all time high today and I've been causing this and I thought today it could be the pop and could be tomorrow could be tomorrow so I think this is on its own but this will lift the market this has one more run up one more push before the stock splits which is Monday of next week so again we're in calls that expire on Friday and I'm waiting 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 so again this is one of these things you're trying to wait 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 patiently we have plenty of time left though plenty of time and the way this stock works and the way that it's been moving, the things that it's been doing, if it doesn't gap up significantly tomorrow, like this could this could be at 1200 tomorrow in the pre-market. If it's not, it could open tomorrow and then push and run straight up there like a rocket. So we'll see. We'll really, really see here. Again, we weren't causing this here. This was a nice trade, a huge call. And again, from tip to tail down in here, 1030 up to this day. So that was like 100 plus points, 120 points almost. So like this, this has the capability. This could get to 1250, 1225, 1250, over 1200 for sure. So just waiting, could happen in the gap tomorrow, could happen in the live day. One more push in the NVIDIA, and then we're probably gonna lay off it for a while after the stock split until the earnings and, or it's, unless something happens significant. But this market, it was in Nowheresville today, Nowheresville today. And again, we don't day trade NVIDIA, this, these are options. And, and again, it depends what strike you did what you paid for these could be pricey, but you have to be able to wear, weather the storm, you know, waiting for the move. Well, I love things to go the second that I call them, and that does happen a lot. It doesn't happen every trade, and this is one where I have a high level of conviction. I'm waiting for the push, and I thought it was gonna be today, but I think it's gonna be tomorrow. So we'll see. Cross your fingers. If you're interested in signing up for the Golden Gap course, the class is this weekend for June, June 8th and 9th. Email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com. Have a great night, everyone.